Hey guys, Chris McKee from The Hitch House. Today, we got a real special motorhome. The 2024 Newmar Mountaineer 3825. Boy, that's a lot to say. Okay, let's get started on why I think this is an awesome motorhome. It's a little shorter than normal, but that makes it special. So first off, 360 camera, including that little camera in the front. 12,500 watt generator. It's gonna power everything in the coach and then some. Chrome mirrors with built-in cameras and turn signals. Keyless entry, fully customizable so you can put your own code in and it has a doorbell. So again, you're in the campground and your friends also have a nice Numar. 3 a.m., couple of cocktails, a little bit of Nicky Nicky nine doors. So let's just start at this first storage compartment here. We have a Dometic fridge freezer. So one side can operate as a fridge, the other is a freezer, or both as a freezer, or both as a fridge. And guys, I'd say that's about, uh, in Canada, we measure things in cases of beer. I'd say that's about three and a half cases of beer, maybe a little bit better. Speaking of actually going through these cabinets, look at this nice look at this nice underslide lighting. This makes all the difference in the world. It's at night. You're trying to get something under your compartments. It just adds that little bit of extra light or ambiance to the campsite. So two power slide trays, each hold about a thousand pounds. It's available with uh, non-power trays as well. So just manual trays. They hold about fifteen hundred pounds. Chrome trim all the way along the bottom. Outside entertainment, guys. Oh. Speaking of cases of beer, I may have had a couple. So Samsung 4K television with Bose soundbar. You have an exterior electrical out here as well in case you want to bring out a DVD player or Amazon Fire Stick, Apple TV, anything like that will work out here. It's a little tight to see in here, but you have two integrated awnings, both Gerard, and as well as power window awnings all the way around. Beautiful thing is, guys, those are frameless, frameless windows. They don't open, but the view you get from them, they're really going after that Prevo look. All in under 39 feet. Guys, this is under 39 feet. You have an articulating tag. Now this, this coach, or this 38-foot Mountaineer, they worked hand-in-hand -hand with Spartan to develop a chassis, again, just for this floor plan. So what it does is it articulates a little more than most of the other Spartan chassis because it is a shorter wheelbase. Now coming back to here, take a look in this. This is real simple. This is just your DEF storage unit. And as well, you can manually air up the bags from right there. So if again, um, God forbid if somebody were in an accident or something like that, the tow truck driver doesn't have to splice into one of your airlines. He can go right from back here. A couple of filters here, your chassis batteries, and your chassis disconnects. So starting from the top of the rear cap, you have a beautiful rear, rear spoiler. They've brought down the backup camera to right here, which just makes more sense. It's a better view of the hitch, and it's a better view of what's immediately behind you, your tow car or anything like that. 15,000 pounds of towing capacity, guys. That is incredible for a coach this size. Again, you're not one of these great big Prevos or a great big King Air going down the highway. You're under 39 feet. So what can you do with that? Well, the 38-foot Mountain Air was designed in part to tow a large, proper-sized car hauler and not be over the legal limit. So that is really what this coach affords you to do is you can bring all your toys and then some. So when you have all your toys, you want to keep them safe. You can either have seven way power brakes, air brakes, and you can also have a backup camera on that trailer through the Voyager system. Let's take a look at this power plant because it's special. So you have your Cummings X12 with 525 horsepower and 1,695 foot pounds of torque. Hey guys, here we are where you perform the second most important job in your mountain air, the driving part. The most important job is a snack coordinator and that's not debatable. 
So let me take you through the cockpit and uh, we'll figure out what we got. So you have dual 10 inch monitors with a digital dash. So you generally control your cameras on this side and you can do your radio navigation and media center on this side. You have your shade control. Your shade control at the front is gonna be your solid non-see-through shade. The visors are gonna be your see-through shades or your sun visors. You have your door lock right here, your generator. Guys, I said earlier, this had a 12.5 uh, thousand watt generator, or sorry, 12,500 watt generator. It's a 10,000 watt generator. You have your docking lights, your overhead fans, and all the controls for your fans. Going through here, you have your automatic high beams, enable and disable, your battery boost, your power window, your air horn, that's cool, wireless cell phone charger, and guys, the ultimate smart wheel. So from just a few years ago, you'd have these two pieces right here, one to scroll through the menu, one to, one to control your windshield wash or windshield washer and your cell phone. What they've added now is this lower part right here that helps control the stereo, your, your flashers, your thank you lights. Hey guys, here we are in the living area of the 3825 Mountain Air. And what a big motor home on the inside. But again, this is all under 39 feet. I'm gonna take you through some of the, the features and benefits of this coach. Now, units like this, we normally take a little while and specify ourselves. This one, Newmar spec'd out for us. Why? Because this was the first one. And because it was the first 3825 Mountain Air, we got, a, we got something else that no other Mountain Airs have, which is kind of cool. So I'm gonna show you that as we go. So first of all, you have the power theater seating with beverage, beverage holders and a huge amount of storage. You have your USB charger right here and as well, each control on either side for the power recliner. Moving into the kitchen, then we'll go to the dining side. So first you have two deep basin sinks, which is real nice. It's all stainless steel, large amount of storage. And guys, this all has pull out drawers, makes it a little easier. Now you take somebody like my mom, for example, who is five foot nothing, she can get to this. She can pull it out, she can reach in. Now, sure, she might not be able to see exactly what she's grabbing, but again, Numar's made that little enhancement just to make life a little bit easier on the shorter people. So you have your Numar color codes right here. So the nice thing is they can identify colors the nice thing is with the Numar color codes, you can identify which color, if you ever need to order touch-up paint or anything like that, you have all the weights of the coach right here. You have your overall length. The Numar Country Club, so Numar has their own country club or their own owner's club that the manufacturer does support. Guys, they hold rallies all across North America. It's a real fun club to be a part of. Moving into the rest of the kitchen. You have your spice rack right there, or if you want to hold a, a dish towel, anything like that. Just a small little cupboard right there. And here you're getting into some, again, more storage space. So you have right there, and then you have your countertop covers and your sink covers that slide in right here. So guys, right here, you have your countertop covers. All four of them fit right here. And while we're right here, look at this flush floor slide right here. So a lot of other manufacturers are gonna transition to a carpet still or another material, or you're gonna see a big crack that you can see down the floor. Numar does a nice job in hiding that. It's an HWH system. And how that works is the slide out actually comes straight up and then in. It's an absolutely remarkable system. They put, they had it in research and development for years before they put it into common practice. Numar is famous for that. They have things, guys, that would blow your mind if you saw their research and development coaches, but they won't put it out into the market until they've perfected it. So you have your Whirlpool convection microwave. Again, just a little more storage and the shelving, and this is adjustable. Right here, you have your silverware storage. Now, guys, you have enough remotes here to sink a ship. Like Now, they've made all that better because you have a universal remote that can control everything. Your true induction cooktop. 
Now, the, the nice thing that Neomark came out with, and this was a few years ago, they were the first to do it, is you can take this right out and put it outside on your campsite if you want to keep all the mess, you know, perhaps you get the kids, grandkids over or husbands over, you know, you, it just helps avoid all the mess. Dishwasher. And again, the amount of storage. Guys, these are all full length drawers. Guys, this is the last little bit of storage in the kitchen. We're going to check out mom's pantry. So you got a big divider down here. Again, you can use for your Corian covers or guys, look at these drawers, the size of them. They're all adjustable. So you can take some out, adjust heights. That is a ton of storage. Again, this is all under 39 feet. So let's take a second to talk why you would want a coach this size or a diesel pusher this size. If you're towing a big 25 or 26 foot stacker trailer, maybe even a 30 foot stacker trailer, this is gonna leave you under the legal length limit in a lot of states or provinces out there. So again, tow 15,000 pounds, you got a tag axle, lots of stability, and all your toys with you. It doesn't get any better than that. Perhaps a new air is just not quite big enough for you, but you want the luxury level. That's why you'd go to something like this, or you have a new air and you want just a little more room. This is gonna be the coach for you guys. Bath and a half, under 39 feet, tons of storage. Guys, right across from the kitchen, we have your master control panel. So I'm just gonna take you to the home screen. So your home screen, you get your date, your tank capacities, your house battery, your chassis batteries. We let the chassis batteries, we left the lights on overnight, we let them die, we're recharging them. Now, and then you go into your, your different legs, your gen, your, uh, gen set, we'll go through that. Your AC power, this goes up your power consumption. Your max charger draw, standby. We are plugged into 50 amp here, even though it says 30. Our house battery, those lithium batteries show 100%. Your generator, you can set up quiet times for it. Voltage drops, it'll come on automatically. Your water system is pretty uh, um, straightforward. You have an auto fill you can turn on. So while you're hooked up and you have um, you know, you're getting ready to leave the campsite. You can turn on the autofill and it goes from city water to filling your fresh water tank. That way you have fresh water while you travel. Your climate control. You have two ACs on this guy. And again, it's a pretty straightforward system. You And this is also backed by an Oasis diesel fire boiler. Oasis, which is Canadian made, is a much more efficient system or it tends to be a much more efficient system than the aqua systems out there. Both systems are great. They're fantastic but the Oasis just has the edge in that category. You have your block heater that you can turn on and off right here. It's a 1500 watt uh, block heater. You have some, your uh, again, more lithium status or your battery, your battery stat. Uh, going to this screen, you have your battery status, which is gonna um, tell you the temperature of the batteries, the, the temperature, the max temperature they've reached, the lowest temperature they've reached, the discharge rate, uh, those sorts of things. Your coach mode. So this is gonna, this is real, the real neat system because again, you have lithium batteries and different rates of charging and uh, you know, your gen, your automatic gen start, if it's enabled or disabled, you have, again, your system for when you're plugged in. If you're actively camping, if you're outdoor and unplugged, if you're outdoor and plugged in, if you're indoor and unplugged, or if you're indoor and plugged in, which we are here. You have your in-floor heat, Three different zones, your lights, your all your shades and guys, this again has numerous famous televator. So just a quick up and that TV right over there is gonna come on up. So I'll go into the next screen. You can control your door locks, guys. Just this last summer, here I am, 6 a.m. trying to sneak out for a, a round of golf with some friends and I get to the door and all I hear is that I was locked in. Who was standing here? my wife. Why? I forgot to do my morning chores. You can lock the cargo, your, your cargo doors right from here as well. Your vent fans or your fantastic vents, sorry, you can turn them all on and off from here. And let's make our way through the rest of the kitchen area and your dinette. So you have an absolutely massive Whirlpool stainless steel fridge with water dispenser, your cake drawer, your vegetable crispers, 
your water filter goes right up and up there. And a massive freezer. Guys, this is on top of the fridge freezer we already have outside. You have your dinette here, which comfortably seats two people, can expand for four. And it's just as simple as this, guys. You have an extra leaf that Numera provides. You have two folding chairs and away you go. You're off to the races. But depending on your like for other people, it looks just as good like that. Just a two person coach. Now, following me to the back here. Oh, one other thing before we go back. You have your central vac kick plate right here and your hose outlet right here. Now, this door is really neat. Newmark came out with this door almost 10 years ago now. And what this does is it appears a little odd when it opens, but it's so you can open it fully with the slide out closed. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna do this to demonstrate the room in the bathroom because it does look tight in there. But the nice thing about Numar is they build a coach that you have room to work in. Now, again, some people may find that funny, but it's an important factor when considering, you know, when you have an extra bath. If you don't have the room to work, what good is the extra bath? Now, moving back here, this is a Hitch House exclusive. We have the only mountain air with a tiltable bed. This was a discontinued option after the first run. It just proved to be a little too expensive for what they were trying to achieve with the mountain air. So this bed is at absolutely no charge. So moving back into the bathroom, we'll explore the other side of the bedroom on the way out. You have a nice corner shower with your water miser system. So what the water miser does is it recycles when you're, when you're dry camping, it recycles your cold water into your fresh water tank until your water's hot enough. You have your wardrobe and safe built in right here, again, with lots of storage. They've really done a great job in maximizing this space. You have your washer dryer right there, stackable. Moving into the uh, bed, back into the bedroom here. You have his and hers wardrobes or hers and hers. Lots of hanging space in this. Again, I'm going to repeat this again under 39 feet <clears throat> guys an absolute ton of storage numar is the only company out there that we know of that actually heats this portion of the slide out as well in the heated floors guys again this specific mountain air is truly one of a kind because of this tilting bed so if you want to know more information about this coach or order your own Give us a call at the Hitch House, 705-722-0008. Again, my name is Chris McKee. I'm the General Sales Manager. We'd love to earn your business.